put your prayer request in the comments there and where you're from. Tell us where you're watching from and put your prayer request so we can stand in faith with you, so we can pray with you. I feel he's got a word for us. I feel he's got a word for us. He just held a tremendous revival in downtown Albemarle called Encounter 21. He pastors the gathering. The gathering. There is a gathering. Huh. A called out ecclesia that God's called him to raise up. I believe God's given him the key to the city that he's in. Ooh. And you understand it's a corporate anointing. It is not your pastor. He is the voice. You give him the apostolic anointing to declare by standing behind him. And I believe he has a word for us tonight. Come on, Pastor. Pastor Paul Jenkins from The Gathering in Abomar. Come on. Come on up here. Come on up here. Come on up here. Keep praying. Keep praying. Listen, uh, when I was asking God what to share tonight, because we want to be quick, because we want to pray, he took me to Luke chapter 5, the story of where God told them to put the nest back out in the deep. You know this story, right? And they're like, I've, we fished all night long. We've caught nothing. Three things stood out to me in that, in that story. Here's the first one. There was a great catch. How many of you would love to see every church in our county full? Yeah. Um, listen, trick question. That's not revival. Full is not revival. Because there's also a breaking in that story. Right? Such a great catch that their own nets began to break. Let me tell you this. Breakthrough happens at your breaking point. So he's looking for a people that say, give me such a great catch that it breaks me, breaks my systems, break is bigger than my church, right? And that's the third thing that we see in that story. We see a partnership, now hang with me. That catch was so big that the people that caught it said, the super spiritual word, help! And they started calling the other boats to come and partner with them in that catch. We want to partner with other believers in the county, right? The catch is too big for you. It's too big for us. God is in the business of doing the uncontainable. Now, while I got you all riled up, let me just mention this. At the end of that story, because we love a big catch and we love to partner, I love this. We love to think that the breaking only happens one time, but it says that when both boats came together, the catch was still so great. Now check this out, that both boats began to break. They began to go under. I'm telling you, the move of God that's coming is going to overwhelm us. Come on, come on, come on. Overwhelm us, God. Overwhelm us, God. Bigger than the gathering, bigger than encounter, bigger than any church in this place. It's overwhelming us. Revival is war. We are revival. W-A, war. That's what revival is. We are revival, not the gathering, not ECC. We are revival. Come on, church. Come on, church. Start to pray right now. Start to pray right now. Yeah. Breakthrough is happening at your breaking point. Don't run from that place. Don't run from that place. Let him break you for the breakthrough. When he breaks you, it brings breakthrough. Let him do that. Let him do that.